guys. Happy New Year. Happy 2020 and welcome to the replay. Happy 2020, you guys. How are you? Welcome to the Yikes, that's way too loud. Um, how is everyone? I'm just pulling up on YouTube. There we go. Hello, hello. Happy 2020. Yay. I hope everybody had a safe and happy and healthy 2019 into 2020. Sadly, the sickness overcame our house. Little Brand has got the flu, even though we did flu shots this year. Or 2019, we did them in like, uh, actually we did them on Halloween. We got them. Um, the sickness still came over our house. So the dude is down for the count. Hi, Donna. Hey, Jenstra. Um, He is down for the count. He's actually sitting on the couch right next to me. My sweet boy. Um, and... Yeah, that's that's where we stand. We had a very, um, very laid back New Year's Eve. Just hung home, had lots of good food. My goodness, we ate and ate and ate and ate and ate. Had, had so many leftovers for today. It was crazy. So um, I got up bright and early and started hitting it hard for 2020. And now I'm getting to play. Um, I've been thinking about my projects for today um, all day long. Um, well, in between Lil Brand's, um, the, our teledoc since the doctor wasn't open and run into CVS to pick up prescriptions and stuff like that. So, um, we're, we're ready to rock and roll now. He's got a dose of Tamiflu in him already. He's already had one neb treatment. You'll need another neb treatment when I'm done. Okay. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's about it. So, Let's chit chat a little before we jump into the live. Um, have you guys seen my post? If you follow my page on Facebook, you will have seen this. I can't remember if I updated it to Instagram too. I may not have. I was in the middle of doing it. Oh, thank you, Donna. Hi, Trish. Trish, I did not forget you. I will be looking at the messages after this. Just remind me too. I totally forgot to go back and look. Um, the, um, let's see, wait, hold on. I just realized, let's see who we have on YouTube, on Facebook. Oh, we got a lot of people over on Facebook too. Um, let's see. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Carrie. Hey, Laura Woods. Hey, Sherry. Hi, Debbie Green. Hi, Brianne. Hi, Margaret Miller. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Heidi. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Mary. Hi, Molly. I know. I hope he feels better too, Heidi. Hi, Nance. Hi, Terry. So, um, New Club Couture launch today for January 2020. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's the cutest. So first thing we're going to talk about is what is Club Couture, okay? So Club Couture is the best DIY home subscription service um, that Chalk Couture offers. It is $19.99 plus tax US or $26.99 plus tax Canadian. Both get free shipping. There's a minimum of a three-month commitment, so if you were to join in January of 2020, you're actually not even getting billed until February the 5th, followed by March the 5th and April the 5th. Oh, that's Bubba's birthday, April the 5th. Um, so you, like I said, will have a three-month commitment. You will have access to Chalk Couture sponsored specials that only Club Couture customers have access to. Yesterday ended our bounce back coupon promo. So all of my Club Couture customers who shopped 
um, and spent either 50 US or 65 Canadian in one shot in my online store in December, you all should have gotten a bounce back coupon. And it's good for the whole month of January. Okay. Uh, you also have access to my private club couture group where I make three additional projects a month with that current month's club couture. Now let's talk about this month's club couture. Oh my gosh, it's adorable. It's a happy Valentine's Day. So if you join in January of 2020, this is an add-on. You can go in and add January's Club Couture for only $19.99 plus tax and shipping US or $26.99 plus tax and shipping Canadian. It'll come with the Happy Valentine's Day size B transfer and three chalk piece singles, which are candy, apple, couture, teal, and peony. I mean, you guys, Look how flipping cute the project is that they made with this. I am dying. It is so freaking cute. Okay. Now, you also have the ability to add the Club Couture, um, the Club Couture transfer into your car. I'm sorry, the Kickstarter kit into your cart once you become a Club Couture member. It's $69.99 US or $93.49 Canadian. It's valued at over $76 US and over $102 Canadian. Comes with the gorgeous 9x12 porcelain steel Ada Magnetic Chalkboard, a board and base, a two-pack of board erasers, a small squeegee, a three-ounce bright white chalk paste, and a multi-tool. So Club Couture is where it's at. It is the best way to go ahead and get started for your 2020 crafting goals. Go ahead and set yourself up with Club Couture under me. If you would like some of the information that I sent you um, messaged over to you, just comment Club right down below, and I'll make sure I message it to you after the live's over, okay? Now, last thing, um, or two other other things I want to talk about. Let's chit chat about 2020 and taking the bull by the horns and going ahead, purchasing the business in the box and building your own empire. Here is our awesome business in a box. It is still part of the winter wonder or winter and wonder um, special, which was for December and January. You're going to get two bonus transfers. So this business in a box is valued, um, it's only $99 plus tax and shipping US or $129 plus tax and shipping Canadian. Comes with five three ounce chalk based, a small squeegee, an apron, a 12 pack of thank you cards, a 12 pack of chocolate chips, a board and base, a 9 by 12 porcelain steel and a magnetic chalkboard, the um, autumn winter catalog, the readme, and where you would normally get seven silk screen transfers. During this campaign, you're getting nine. So you're getting two bonus transfers during the month of January. You do not want to miss out. So you, you totally would be saying to, might be saying to yourself right now, you know, Jess, that's great that you're showing me everything you get, but girlfriend, I've got a lot of questions that I need answered first and no problem. I've got answers. All you need to do is comment, join down below, and I will message you the link to my opportunity group. I've already been throwing people into there left and right today to get all of the information they need. Um, the Opportunity Group has a video that's about 15 minutes long, but it goes over every single detail that you need to know in order to make an educated decision about not just joining Chalk Couture, but joining my team. I want this to be a decision that you're happy with in 2020, and I want you to be ready to rock and roll, to start building your empire, and start paving the way for the things that you want in life, okay? So that is that. Now, last but certainly not least, before we get into our super cute project, let's discuss the creative kickstart. This is the last month. It is while supplies last or January 31st, you guys. You have the ability to choose from two different bundles or you can pick both bundles. They're both $29.99 plus tax and shipping US or $39.99 plus tax and shipping Canadian. You have the choice of getting choose happy or live your dreams or like I said, both. They both come with their own size B transfer, like I just said. They're, they both come with a white 9x12 Grayson chalkboard, and they both come with two packs of um, chalk piece. The Choose Happy comes with Peony and Guava, and the Live Your Dreams comes with Sage and Couture Teal. Now, you do not want to miss out on getting your hands on this super awesome creative kickstart. Okay, like I said, it is while supplies last. Don't miss out. It is such a great kit. Okay, I think I said everything. The only other thing I want to say is that you guys in my VIP group, if you are not a designer and you are not in my VIP group, you may not be working with another designer. I want to be your designer. My winter retreat in a box open today. I've already filled about a fifth of the spots that I allotted to be open for this month. So you don't want to miss out on your spots because this retreat in a box is going to be pretty flipping awesome. I have so much planned for it. If you've been loving what I've been doing with the tier trade decor, you're not 
not going to want to miss out on the winter retreat in a box. All you need to do is comment me down below. I'll get you into my VIP group and you can see the details for signing up. There's only 12 days left to sign up because I close it off at a certain time or it could shut off tomorrow if we fill all the spots. So make sure you get into that. Okay. Now, if you are catching me live, hi, Levita. Hi, Dusty Camp. Hi, Lori. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Pam. Hi, Mary Beth. Uh, old timey Valentine's. Yes, Nancy, for sure. Hi, Lori Robbins. Hi, Cynthia. Hi, Dale Jones Stewart. Hey, oh, Johnny, I know. I love it too. You're watching me on TV, Denise. That's awesome. Hi, Kristen Hildebrand. Hey, Annie Riches. How are you? Hi, Terry. Let me check back over to YouTube real quick. Hey, Jenny Davis. Happy New Year. Okay, so let's chit chat really quickly. Um, we are, <coughs> we have, um, let, or let's see. If you're catching me live, please say hashtag live. If you're catching the replay, please say hashtag replay. If this is your first time hearing about Chalk Tour, or you may have heard about it, but you're not currently working with a designer, please put a one down below because I would love to be your designer. If you are already an amazing Chalk Tour designer, please put a two down below and throw me some hearts. If you are catching me on Facebook, first and foremost, please go to the tippy top of the page, hit the like button, and make sure you turn your notifications on so you know when I go live. If you are not a Chalk Tour designer, bottom left-hand side of your mobile device is that share button. I would love it if you would click share. If you are catching me on YouTube, first and foremost, please, right under the live video is the subscribe button. Please hit that subscribe button, and right next to it is the bell. Turn the bell on so you get notified. You guys know when Facebook goes wonky, I can still broadcast live from YouTube, so you don't want to miss out. So um, if you're on YouTube, though, under the live video next to that subscribe button is the share button. Once again, I would love it if you would click share. Now, if you'd like to find me on social media, I can be found in a few places. My YouTube channel, for starters, just about at 800 videos. I think after tomorrow's, we're at 800. Um, 800 chocolate videos, you guys. You can find me on Craft and Instamp and No G's. We dropped the G's in New Jersey, okay? Um, go in and look back at all of my prior projects if you want. Um, put me on a loop. I mean, you probably wouldn't want to do that. That would get annoying really quickly. But you might want to watch some videos to get some inspiration, okay? Um, Instagram, I am the exact same handle, crafted and stampin' no G's. There is tons of project pics to hopefully bring you some inspiration so that way you will love what you see. Um, you can go on and get me there. And finally, last but not least, Facebook, I am Chalk Tour with Jessica. You will find everything on my Facebook. You're going to find my lives. You're going to find... Instagram posts coming over. You're going to see my blog posts coming over. You're going to see up to the minute updates as things are launching or things are selling out, which I will have the updated retiring list in my VIP group. I know some items that are truly retiring right now. You don't want to miss out on them. I'll get them in my VIP group and I'll post them here too. Okay. So let's get our camera ready. Here's a little something while I do that behind the scenes. And then we're gonna, we are gonna create Ouch. Hey, Roberta. Hi, Deborah May. Hi, Kaylee. Happy New Year, Darlene. Hi, Claudia. Did I say hello, Claudia? Hi, Ellen Roberts. How are you? Um, which, with your boxes, do you have a theme each time or just a bunch of scenes? No, it's a theme, Johnny. Definitely a theme. Uh, I watched some from 2018 last night. Oh, I love it. I'm so glad you watched some of them too, Darlene. Okay, so let's chit chat. Number one, I've got a cup of coffee. It's only my second cup, which is sad, and I've been up for hours. But I've got a monster-sized headache, so I need to have some coffee. All right, so let's recap some things that I've already created for our tier tray decor. Don't look at all of this mess over here. Just pretend it's not even there. All right, so yesterday's live, we created this super cute little burlap board with the sweet little um, buffalo plaid heart with the XOXO from the... Um, sprinkled with love transfer. Okay. We did that yesterday. We did this sweet little gesso board with the February 14th transfer, the, our little subway art. And I made to made sure to do, you know, our love here to make it look like a repeating theme. And we have this fun little heart that is made out of this, like, I don't even know. It's like wiry stuff, but that is super cute. Oh, my Nomi. Can you get my Nomi for me real quick? I can. Okay. Um, let me, Brand's going to bring down the gnome that we did last night. Stir it there for now. Where is it? It's up on the counter? The uh, block. 
Island. Um, Island. Yes. Yep, just give me a second because I just realized something. I'm on my phone for the life. Totally didn't pay attention to that. So I'll send it in just a few. All right. Um, okay. The other thing we need, let's see. So I made some I love you uh, or some rolling pins that say I love you. Happy Valentine's Day. And XOXO. Whoops, if I do it the right way. Okay. We made a sweet little candy jar. All right, using the French country and some shimmer red on some cardstock, and we went around the jar. We made a fun little frame that I got from the store. It actually has handwritten font and it says kisses. XOXO. I thought maybe I could add some candy into it as well. I thought that would make it cute, and that's why I have that here. That is the one I made, goofball, the pink one. I thought it was pink, but this is the only one I saw on the island. No, it's not on the island. It's right on the um, cabinet that has my Ray Dunn, yeah. my hot cocoa bar. Silly. Okay. <laughs> this was made with last month's Club Couture, um, Less House, More Home. We did it on just a little house-shaped piece of wood. Now, I'm going to tell you, at my favorite store in the specific section... You guys know where I'm talking about. I can't say it. They have house pieces of wood that you can legit sand off with a hand piece of sandpaper and repaint it your color to make something like this. Okay. Thanks, Beeb. My Nomi. I'm going to show you the little Nomi, how cute he turned out. Here's our sweet little gnome that we made yesterday too. Like okay. Fun. With the, once again, sprinkled with, or uh, yeah, the sprinkle with love transfer. We got to put our little Nomi back here. He needs to be front and center. He's adorable with my little pink fur. Oh, I love him. Ouch, I'm so proud of me. Okay, then we made some trees. Um, guys, trees are going to be hopping all the time. You're going to want to get your hands on them. So we made with the larger buffalo plaid and some shimmer red. We did this one with the Christmas tree patterns transfer um, with peony and shimmer red on a chalk chip with the sprinkled with love. We did mistletoe kisses who would have thought we'd be using a mistletoe transfer for valentine's but it has kisses included so cute then we did the jetem uh transfer and i'm trying to say it right and i'm thinking of how the a l e x a lady says it um i don't want to say it because then she's going to start talking um we did this on our palette frame we painted it in red first we did this in the black velvet and peony um, we did, hold on, I'm trying to show everything and then I can put it to the side. We made fun farmhouse beads with, um, last month's Club Couture mini buffalo plaid and the sprinkled with love transfer and a chocolate chip. And we did a love heart box. Once and the majority of this stuff that I chalked on, I got at my favorite store in that certain location, in that certain section. Hi, Kyle. Hey, girl. Happy 2020, Shalene. So there is that. Okay. Super cute. And then I forgot that I made these and I had these hidden um, because I had planned. I had them like staged up on my one area to take a picture. I forgot that I did these. Once again, got these letters at my favorite location at 90% or 70% off. I got XOXO and I did the X with just um, the... What is this called? Chocolate chip with sprinkled with love. And I did the, um, what is this? Woven plaid with shimmer red and peony. And I just re redid it for two more. And I'm going to put this into some sort of garland. Um, or I could put it inside a tiered tray. I haven't decided yet. Whatever I decide to do, though, we can do. So that's a recap of everything that we've made for our tiered tray decor. We're going to keep on keeping on today. Now, at my favorite location in the world, my favorite store to shop at, look what I found. Do you see it? It was only $3. Do you see it? It is the cutest thing ever. And guess what we've got? Guess what we've got in the Sprinkled with Love? You're a llama fun. Oh my goodness gracious. We're going to make... You're a llama fun on a chocolate chip to have it in our tiered tray, okay? It's the cutest thing ever. We're going to do that. Then, once again, in my favorite location, I found these two little sprinkle jars, okay? They're like chunky sprinkles. And we've got a transfer that says sprinkled with love. 
okay, in that sprinkled with love transfer. So we're going to be doing that on a chocolate chip. See, sprinkled with love, 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 love. Sprinkled with Jimmy's. They did have that on the one package. It said Jimmy's. Yeah. Now I'm hoping that it's going to fit on this little heart. We're not doing that one on a chocolate chip. Sorry. We're going to do, yikes. We're going to do this on a little heart. Okay. Then we're going to come in and this is an idea that I found from sweet Annie, who if Annie, if you're still watching, this is all your idea, girl. And I thought, oh, this is going to be perfect in a tiered tray. So we're going to be using one of our tags that we still have. And if, I'm telling you guys, if you don't have them, stock up because I'm going to be using them every single time in a tiered tray. Um, I'm going to do the word adore on a tag. And I'm thinking I'm also going to do hugs and kisses. I haven't fully decided yet, but that's what we're going to do. Okay. So we're going to make a few little things today. Um, and then I think tomorrow is for real going to be the last day of my tier tray series, because I think I'm running out of tier tray things. Um, so there's that. I know a little llama Heidi. How cute is it? Hey, Jana, how are you? Let me check in on YouTube. See if we got anybody new. Hi, Betsy cash. Welcome. Gesso is the gesso is the J sound. Yay. Thank you, Jenny. I wasn't sure how to say it. Um, Hey, where in HL did you find the mini rolling pins? Trish online. That's how I found them. Um, Deptford had them a bunch of months back, but I wound up just finding one line. Okay. So we've got that done now. Sage Roberts. Good morning or good afternoon. How are you? Okay. Let's, we need to scroll over here a little more because I don't need you guys seeing my big giant mess. There it goes. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's do this. So let's talk about your llama fun with this sweet little llama. Is this not the cutest flipping thing? And guess what? I can keep these succulents alive because they're fake. No killing off the plants. So let's go ahead and let's, oh, I have it out already. So we're going to get, here's what we're going to do. Actually, first things first, we are going to paint our heart. So that way it is all done and it could be sitting and you know what we're going to do when I'm white. So that way it can be all ready and dry by the time we're done doing the llama fun. I feel like I'm yelling. Am I yelling? Ow. I know. It's hurting my ears. Do you hear that? You are not right. Brand's making fun of how loud I am. Okay. So let's get our little heart painted. I found these little hearts, um, Michael's, I think, for like, I don't know, 49 cents or something. Something ridiculously cheap like that. I only got like two or three of them. Because I don't need them for everything. I only wanted to do it for some things. Hey, Heather, how are you? Hi, Lisa. Welcome, Lisa Rand. You're new to my page. That's awesome. Are you a designer, Lisa? Or are you a new customer to Chalk Couture? Okay. All right. So we've got that all painted. Okay. Get a baby wipe to get this off my hands. Got lots of paint on my hands, which is very typical for me. I can't wait to see you next week, Heather. Hi, Cindy. How you doing, girly? Yay, Cindy! That's awesome. That is so great. Hi, Sage. Ah, well, I hope you have a good work day, Heather. Hopefully you get to go home and relax very soon. Okay, let's get the stride so I don't get it on. You guys, I'm still in my pajamas. Yes, I ran to CVS to get little brand's prescription of my pajamas. Please, no judgment. I said today was going to be a, a relaxing work from home day. Hi, Vicki. How are you? That's all you went to, Cindy, and you found it? That's amazing. What are you doing? Oh.
Okay. Happy New Year, Vicki. All righty. So that is ready. We'll pop that to the side. Okay, so you're a llama fun. We're going to do that one now. Now, here is what I am thinking. What? Oops, I forgot to label the back. So as you guys read, our transfers are reusable over and over and over again. Hey, 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 can you give me... Do you see that iris color right there? It's like a purple. Nope, go up on that. Nope, clear tray, babe. Up in that one. Yeah, come over towards me. Third one from the back. Yes, may I have that? Thank you. Yes, 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 yes. Awesome. Okay, as you guys read, um, our transfers are reusable over and over and over again. So we want to write on the back of them before we use them. Okay, so we are going to do your llama fun. And I'm going to attempt to make this purple that's on this llama with, I think I'm going to do some ocean mist and, oh, little brand sick, with some ocean mist and iris. I'm going to see what happens, okay? Let's get a stir stick and stir this up, okay? I just want to lighten it a little bit, and this purple looks like it has... You know what? Actually, I'm going to use bright white. Where is my bright white paste? I know I had my bright white out. Hold on. Oh, no, I didn't have my bright white out. It's right here. Okay. Yikes. And we're going to use couture teal, because we want to match this cute little llama, huh? You guys, my desk needs to be cleaned up so badly. It is not even funny. Oh, gosh. I'm going to cause a huge avalanche. There it goes. Okay. So let's do a little bit of the iris. Hey, Mary. Let's see. You just realized the mini bees? What mini bees? New to Chalk Couture, but seen it done thing. Oh, Lisa, awesome. I'm going to, I'm sending you the link to my VIP group. So that way you can join it then, Lisa. I would love to be your designer, okay? Oh, hi, Linda Carroll. How are you? Hey, Mary. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and let's stir this up. Okay. go. All right. So here's what we're going to do. We are gonna, we're going to add a little bit. And this is why I love our messy mat. You guys, that's what I call our, our self healing mat. I call it a messy mat sometimes. Now let's get all that excess off and let's rub these two together. Oh yeah. That's like closer to the color I was looking for. Look at that. Look, it almost matches the purple. It needs a little bit more of like a, maybe a pink undertone in this or a little bit of a red, but is much closer than the iris was. So we're going to use couture teal and this color that I just made to do our Yura Llama fun. Ouch. Hello, Melinda. Okay. Okay. Ready? So we stirred up our chalk piece to a nice yogurt-like consistency. Now let's add it. So I'm going to do my little llama in teal, and I'm going to do your llama fun in the teal and the color I created. And I'm going to do llama, the word llama for this, in the couture teal. And I just stuck my finger in that pretty purple color I made. Nice. Okay, so hold on. Need another little one. Bye, medium. Have a safe trip home. Bye, medium. Oh, okay. All righty. Medium is Kyle's son. We call him medium because he is a Brandon as well. And... So there's big brand, medium brand, and little brand. Okay, let's see. 
Oh my gosh, that is the cutest thing ever. You're a llama fun. So fun, you guys. Oh my gosh, I love it. All right, so we got that. So let's just put this. Oh, for real? Are you kidding me? Hold on, guys. Sorry. What is that a reminder for? There it goes. Okay. So we got that guy all chalked. Let's cover up our white, our iris, and the couture teal. Okay. Really? Got like no pay, please. Okay. Let's just get this closed up. All right, let's make sure this is dry and then we're gonna use our I'm thinking I want to glue it on there but I'm not sure how I feel about that I could also do what let's let's hole punch it for right now and then worst case scenario we could always just tie a little a little ribbon through it so what I'm gonna do is just use my crocodile and punch it teeny tiny little hole okay I love the iris with white too, cat. Didn't it turn out so pretty? Oops, and somehow I managed to get. Okay, so I've tied a little piece of twine through. And like I said, we can either do one thing or another. Now, hold on. Let me just get this area cleared up. So that way I can keep on moving on. I do love this color we need. Maybe I should, you know what, before I finish your llama fun, I'm going to go on and do a tag because I think I want to make the color I just made. I want to use the color I just made. So I'm going to be using our little tag minis. Okay. Six of them come in a package and we're going to use the February 14th transfer and we're going to do the word adore and we're going to do, I think, hugs and kisses. I haven't fully decided yet, but hopefully I have enough of the color that I created to do the word adore. I got to be careful how I stick this on here because I don't want it to go, ah, which I just did. Just said I didn't want that to happen. Awesome sauce. Okay. Probably not the brightest bulb in the box to go and mix the color right dead center of my mat here where I have place to work. Okay. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you guys can see off to the side here because that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to go off to the side because it is all over. Here it goes. I can just go like this. Okay. That looks pretty centered. Bye, medium. Be safe getting home. Text your mom to let her know you made it home safe, please. Don't make her worry. And I hope you feel better, okay? Of course. We'll see you again soon, hopefully. Be safe. Oh, that. Oh. Womp, womp. I had a little bleeder. All right. Let's see if I can get it off quickly, though. That turned out adorable, though. Adore, adorable. He had a bleeder. That's what I get for not checking to make sure I didn't have any air bubbles. Oh, that was no problem. It came right off. Okay, I like that we, there we go. How cute is that a door? Gosh, you guys, there is a, there's a really big mess on my desk. What? I think it's called your whole desk.
Okay, now hold on. Now that it's all dried, I can go back over some of the spots. Someone's popular. You okay, Bob? Okay, there we go. There's a door that looks even cuter. All right, now before I get this all over myself again, let's get rid of this color here. That turned out super cute, by the way. What are we looking for? Right, Johnny? It would not be me. <laughs> Hi, Mary Spinelli. Hold on. Where did you get the punch? Oh, yeah, Levita, you can get it. Oh, gosh. Any of the craft stores have it. Amazon has it. If you message me, I can send you the direct link to it right on Amazon because I have that set up for, you know, if people need it. Okay, so got the adore tag done. How cute, right? All right, I've got to really scrub this a different way. Okay, now let's clean this up a little bit more here so we have room to move because there's another thing I'm supposed to be doing. What am I supposed to be doing? I forgot. Okay, hold on. Okay, let's check in on YouTube. You're welcome, Trish. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go back here. All right, so we've got a door. Oh, that's what we are going to do. Let's decide. Where's what I do with it? Where did I stick the chocolate chip? Is it in front of my face and I'm missing it? Hold on. It's got to be in front of my face. It is. Okay. So you're a, you're a llama fun. So do we want to just tie it on to the little llama and like kind of have it dangling? That would maybe be cute. Or do we just want to have it on like a little itty bitty stand and tie like a bow and hiccups? I'm so sorry. I don't know where they're coming from. Hey, Timmy. Hi, Stacy Pete. Buy your coffee. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a, a goofball. Okay. It's because I've got way too much on my desk. I don't usually have this much. I usually clean up nightly, but it's been a little rough. All right. So let's decide. You guys let me know what you want to do with that. We still have to add um, some cute little ribbon to this. I'm going to do some Valentine's fun ribbon. I love it. I know there was, oh, and I wanted to do some hearts on this too. So let's do some pink hearts. Hold on. Let's finish up a door. Here we go. Let's see. We'll use this guy. We'll use this guy and we'll use this guy. Okay. Hold on. I am not happy with how that spread. There we go. Much better. Much better. Okay, so let's do maybe some peony with the adore. What do we think? Some peony will be cute, right? Oh, yeah, that mixes up beautifully. Would be cute on a wood block. Oh, totally, cat. Absolutely. Absolutely agreed. Oh, 
multi tool. Little itty bitty areas with these little hearts. I love this homespun hearts. Something on this multi tool. What is happening here? What is on this? Ugh. Tell me it had dried up color on it. It did. go oh that's a cute little heart let's put that over here let's go off up here And let's try this. Oh, this is so cute. We'll add this last guy on. Oh, adorable. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. How cute is that? Oh. So cute. All right. So we'll add some ribbon onto a door. Let's close up. Oh, you know what? We're going to leave Peony open because now we're going to do our little heart. Hopefully, I made it big enough. Where's the transfer? Sprinkled with love is the one we're going to use. Okay, so I'm going to get my transfer trimmers. Where are my transfer trimmers? They're hidden. Huh. I have my paintbrushes. Okay. And I'm going to just simply cut it out. Okay. And I'm going to label the back. And we're going to tie it around the, the cute little sprinkle jars that I found. Sprinkled with love. That is the way I abbreviated it. Hey, Nikki and Julie. Hello, Melissa Garcia. You're kicking yourself for not ordering them. Cat, you need them. You totally need them. Let's check it on YouTube. Hi, Jill Stevens. You're not catching the replay, Jill. I'm live, girlfriend. You can be happy to know that you are catching me live. Okay. Ready? So let's get sprinkled with love. Trying to make sure that that's like centered. Oh gosh, it's not even close. Go over a little bit more. I'm trying to center. There we go. We are centered. Okay, so we are going to use some candy apple and some peony. And we are going to do 
we're going to do this transfer because it's super cute. Okay. And I realize it's probably super tough to see this because this is a teeny tiny one. So let's zoom in a little. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make um, sprinkled with and peony love in red and the sprinkles in red, I think. Okay. And I'm going to use a multi-tool for this as well because this is teeny tiny, this area. It's probably very hard for y'all to see me do this. How about sprinkled with love all in candy apple and all of the Jimmy things and peony? I think that'll be better. Okay. Where's my multi-tool? Here it is. This off doesn't try. Oh, that's so cute! It's adorable. Oh, sprinkled with love. I love it, and we are gonna definitely tie it together on these two little cute jars. Hold on, let's get our jars closed so that way we have room to move. I have so many things that need to get washed over here, you guys. Oh, my gosh. It's crazy. Let's make a switch. Uh, wipe. Okay. All righty. So, let's dry this up. Hey! I'm going to be throwing... The transfer trimmers. Okay. So I've got these cute little jars that already have some twine wrapped around them. Okay. And after we get done these, we're done, you guys. We are all done. And like I said, I will have one more episode for my tear tray series and then we're going to go to some other valentine's decor and some other everyday life decor okay that came off a lot easier that one all right so let's see hopefully i'm hoping i don't shatter the wood doing this let's see I didn't. Yay. Perfecto. Sprinkled with love. Let's see. Let's see if I can tie these two together. Hmm. You know what? I just might tie it like this. I think I'm going to hot glue the bottles together. Because I think they will stay. They already have a better record. I think they will stay together better. It's like us. It doesn't split. It's just. Ugh, my fat fingers. What are you making them? Trying to make some decorations for my tiered trees. Okay, so my hot glue gun should be plugged in. I could have sworn I did plug it in. Seriously, I did not. Oh, I'm a butthead. 
Hold on. Let's get that plugged in. Okay. In the meantime, while we're doing that, let's get out our We have a little piece of twine here. Just while we're waiting, we'll get our door tag tied. And I want to get some other ribbon on with it. But you do get part of the tag minis. You do get some cute little twine. Okay. So we can start off with that. While I get out my other ribbon, I think I put some. back what a bummer i was just thinking in my head too it's been a little bit since we lost sound all right so i see youtube is back and i found out that when i do that on youtube I, the quality comes back in really, really crappy. There it goes. All right. So we're back. Sorry, you guys. What a bummer. I hate when that happens. I really do. All right. So let's just, I was just, what I was saying was this twine is fun. Um, they had a bunch of Valentine themed twine in my favorite store, which we all know what that is, in my favorite section. If you guys have been watching for a while, even if you're brand new, I think by this point you figured out what my favorite store is. Um, if you have not and you still want to figure it out um, or you need help figuring it out, I am happy to tell you what it is. Just message me. Aw, I'm glad, Kyle. I hope you love what I'm doing. It's fun. It's really fun. I'm just getting all of my strings all tied up. There we go. 
So how cute is that? Now it's so much cuter. And if I had a little, like, I don't know, like something that I could tie on, I would probably tie it on. Okay, this should be nice and hot. This thing yesterday, if you guys watched, I got burned many a times. Many. So all I'm doing is gluing these two little jars together. Okay, I'm just hot gluing them. Oh my God, I have so much fur on this from doing the gnome yesterday, you guys. It's crazy. But the good thing is, I think I've burned myself so much that I don't even feel the hot glue anymore now. So there's that. Hello, Shaky McShakerson. What's going on here? Okay, so I'm going to just stick all the glue on the back end. So that way you don't see it on the front end. See? Really don't see it okay and what we'll do is we'll tie it onto the bottles just like so and that hot glue already sat like it's already making the stuff to stay together so that is awesome sauce. There we go. Whoopsie. And we've got sprinkled with love. How adorable. So we did sprinkled with love. Your, oops, let's take our tag off. Sprinkled with love. Your Alama fun. Let me get that. I still don't know what we should do with it. I don't know if we should tie it on, if we should just maybe glue it on, just sit it next to it. I don't really know. I mean, he's cute. I don't really know what to do, though. I know that that bow is way too big. I know that much. It takes up everything. We could just, we could just glue it on just like that. I don't know what we should do. What do you guys think we should do with this? That way we can get this done. I'll wait for you guys to chime in. I'm back, Jill. I'm back. Trish, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. What do you guys think? Should I... Hi, Vicky. Vicky, I am back. I promise. I feel like this is a bow is not going to cut it. And I feel like this is, and obviously this is way too long. So let's figure out. Hi, Vicky. Hi, Debbie. Uh oh, am I not going to see comments? Can you guys hear me? Should we glue on? The Yura Llama Fun, should we tie it on? Oh, I forgot it was zoomed in. Hold on, you guys aren't even seeing it. Okay, should we tie it on, glue it on? What should we do? Don't mind this crafting mess. Hey, Michelle, how are you? Hey, Jazz. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Joyce. Terry says, hang it on its neck. Shalene says, just glue it. Darlene says behind his back and high end, but the llama will be covered, not the wording though. <laughs> you know what we could do? We could we could glue it to the back end. That's a great idea, you guys. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just glue it. I'm gonna just do a little bit of taggies here with some twine. Get rid of that. And we're gonna glue it back here. That's what we're gonna do. Boop. Poor little brand. You okay, dude? That's puke, guys. That's going to be puke. Okay. Oops, needs to go up a little bit more. You're a llama fun. And it's standing. Happy New Year, tight on. Of course. 
we can't start. I think that's snooze. I hope it was snooze because I do have to do that one. I think it turned out cute. You're a llama fun. How adorable. Uh-oh, is that, is that really glued? Hold on. I'm going to have to add some more glue, you guys. It's weird because the hotter the glue gets, the longer it takes to glue on. Which makes zero sense, I know. But that's what I've noticed. But you guys, we've got a ton more decor that we've made for our sweet little... This is not sticking at all. For our sweet little tear trays. All right, hold on. I got to just hold this for a sec. I hope you guys have enjoyed all the projects we've been making. Um, you're going to definitely want to come back. Hi, Diana. Um, you're going to definitely want to come back tomorrow because tomorrow I think is going to be the last episode of my tear tray series. Um, I may make another little piece here and there, but I have some other ideas that I want to get done for decor so that way I'm ready to go when it comes time to decorating for Valentine's Day. There we go, you guys. Now it's stayed. You're a llama fun. I need it'll stand up. Adorable. Yay. All right, you guys. Whoopsie. Hold on. There we go. Thanks so much for joining me on New Year's Day. I hope you guys have a wonderful, happy, healthy, and wealthy 2020. Um, I thank you for being um, here with me. I thank you for sharing in my life. I thank you for supporting me. Um, here's to an amazing 2020 with all of us. Um, happy New Year, Diana. Hi, Norma. Um, here's to an amazing 2020 for all of us. Um, and what more can I say? Let's all be crafty this year, right? All right, you guys, take care. I'll be back tomorrow with another super fun project, part five of our Valentine's Tear Tray series. Talk to you guys later. Bye.